The best indoor plants will add instant greenery to your home as well as introducing some valuable health and mood boosting benefits. The well-being enhancing benefits of plants are well documented from studies which shows hospital patients heal faster when they have a view of greenery while they recover. To research showing a significant increase in care home residents, happiness levels when given a house plant to care for. As if making a healthier and happy year was not enough, the best indoor plants also create feel-good vessel well focal point in a room. They can bring vibrant, aliveness into our man-made spaces, providing plenty of green, the color known for its restful, relaxing psychological properties, and of course, for those of us who have small courtyard or balcony gardens, indoor plants offer the perfect way to maximize our plant growing space. <music>
When putting together a wish list of the best indoor plants, it's good to choose options that thrive under a variety of conditions, as different rooms throughout the home and zones within each room can have very different high levels and temperature, depending on their aspect. The Boston fern has a liking for slightly lower light condition and high moisture levels, making it one of the best plants for bathrooms. As a native to tropical climates where it grows amidst the last vegetation on the rainforest floor, the Boston fern is used being in the diffuse light of the rainforest canopy, such as fall suns as scorched in fronts, but isn't fan of depth shade either. It's worth of the effort to find a spot that suits it. However, as one's content, it will thank you with a wonderful mass of air purifying foliage. In a bright room, it's good bed to position it so far from the window as possible, while in a darker room, it can be set closer to natural light. The snake plant is one of the easiest indoor plants to take care for. In fact, it's often described as indestructible. It continues to release oxygen even at night, making it good plant for bedrooms, where even if you forgot to water it for a while, it won't bear a grudge. This snake plant is a succulent so can tolerate droughts well, making it quick to recover if you neglected to water for a while. Succulents generally prefer to underwatered rather than overwatered, so err on the side of caution and follow the rules of less is more. Spider plants is incredibly easy to care for, happy in low light condition and one of the best indoor plants for AC propagation. It also removes several toxins from the air while continuing to release oxygen all throughout the night. It works while well sat on top of the furniture or hanging from the ceiling, with its arching leaves and trailing stems of baby spider plants adding graceful greenery to the corner of a room. Spider plants are renewed for sending out lots of shots from which multiple babies or spiderlets rapidly grow. You can leave this until they are family large in size if you like the lock of them trailing from a hanging plant or from the top shelves of bouquets. But new growth deplight the mother plant's resources, so cutting them off to keep the original plant in optimum health is a good idea. Spider plant's propagation is easy. The baby plants generally roots easily in water or soil will soon create a lush new plant, perfect for gifting to a friends, family, neighbors, strangers, and you will soon have a plenty to go around. The distinctive Dracaena fragrance or corn plant looks like a bit of small palm tree, with a thick husky stem and proportion of sword like foliage at its crown, also known as a dragon plant for its sometimes fiery thick leaves. This plant grows naturally in African soils, so it's used to hot climates and little water, hence, being one of the best indoor plants, as well as forgive some neglect. Although they grow to great heights in their native environment, endures the Dracaena will grow slowly. Compared to the most plants, the Dracaena needs very little water and is generally low maintenance. It will be benefit from regular dusting of leaves to unblock pores in dry environment. It will be happy to receive a light missing to give its leaves a renewed shine. Delicate arching branches and a plethora of shapely glossy leaves makes this one of the most elegant ender plants. However, as it often the case of such beauty, the way pink fig does require a little more maintenance than most of our other houseplant options. This plant can go nearly 100 feet but there is no danger of that enders or growing conditions mean at maximum it might be eventually get to 6 to 8 feet. Still pretty impressive though. If you don't want to get at this big then prone the fig tree to keep a two or more manageable and a healthy size. The last but not the least, aloe vera plant. This plant has been prized for thousands of years for its medicinal properties. It's often recommended for the kitchen as the sap provides a handy natural first aid kit that can be applied to minor burns or sunburn. This aloe vera plant likes plenty of light needing 6 to 8 hours of bright indirect sunlight a day and even being tolerant of the bright direct light of a sunny windowsill. Choosing the right houseplant for your home or office can require more than just a visual attraction. Filling our indoor spaces with houseplant provides not only a verdant environment but several have been known to reduce stress and purify the air. This is Tony Nabuhay Vlogs. Thank you and keep safe. Yeah.